everybody. <sighs> Hi guys. No. Hi guys. No. Hey everybody! So today I thought we would give nail art a try. Quick story time. When I was like 12 years old, I started getting really into nail art. So I bought loads of equipment. This is like little things of like tape. And these are tip guides. And these little tiny brushes I bought all this stuff on Amazon.com, but um, never used it and never learned how to use it. So I thought this was the perfect time to learn how to do nail art. So I am going to look on Instagram, follow my Instagram, underscore Olivia Holreiser. I'm going to go on Instagram and search the hashtag nail art and see what I can find. I have a few nail polishes. I don't know if they're in date, but. Ooh, no. These all look very complicated. Maybe I should just sort of freestyle it. I think I'm just gonna freestyle it. Come, come closer. Come a little. Come closer. These are the- I honestly cannot remember the last time I painted my own nails. And generally my nails are pretty unattractive. Like, they, like, my hands are very dry. I don't know if you get dry hands during winter, but it's just the worst. And I always moisture- this is very- Watery. Did I mention that I'm not good at nail art? This is what we have so far. <laughs> oh, I want to use this stuff. This is cool. How do I? I don't. Got it. So now I just stick it on my nail. Okay, so I've wrapped that around my nail. We're going for like an Easter egg vibe. Okay, wait, stop it. What the? So now I'll take the blue. And no. And just stick it on. Here's what that looks like. It's a little messy. I mean, it's still a little sticky. But I think it's probably done. Okay, so that's nail number one. on my fingers okay so now i'll do another one i want to use some of these so for this finger i'm gonna go for like multiple colors i'm gonna start with this very fashionable sharpe pink that looks pretty good i'm happy with that while that one dries, because I think I didn't let the other one dry long enough, I'm gonna do another finger. Oh, glitter. So I think with the glitter, you have to just paint your nail and then like shove it in and then it sticks on. So here are the sparkles. Just, boop, nailed it. Yeah! Look how pretty that is. Ah, oh, hell yeah, I'm great at this. Okay, that feels pretty dry now, so I'm gonna put one of these stickers on it to do a shape. So I need to, I need to cover, wait, how do I, if I put this here, like so, then do I just paint, yeah, all the way over. Okay, wait, ah! So I've definitely got it on my nail, um, but I've also really got it on my finger. Ah. Okay, there's bits of fluff on that now. So nail number two, she's a mermaid. I'm gonna try and do a flower on this one. Oh no, I'll put my finger in my finger. So this one's gonna be tie-dye inspired by my top. Oh no, I just did it again. Oh no. No! Oh, now it's really furry. I want this one to be good. So this nail went really well and the camera won't focus on it, but 
it went really well. I mean, like in comparison to the other ones, that one's gonna be a flower. So for this pinky nail, I think I'm just gonna use this nice light pink. Maybe I'll do like, like a stroke of every pink that I own. Oh, that's like barely anything. So I'll let that dry. Is this dry? Okay, that's like dry enough to do the flower, I think. Dot, dot. Oh, now it's like a triangle. Okay, so I'll turn that into um, like sort of leaves and then I'll bring it up here. This is the stem. So I think I can peel this off now. So let's see. Oh my God, okay, so that actually like totally worked. Look at that. That's the tie-dye one. That's sort of the expressionistic one. I'm gonna move on to the left hand. Right hand. Probably should have done the right hand first. So we're gonna start with this silver and do like stripes. The silver is like the base. And then once that's dried, I'm gonna use one of those little tiny brushes to do like gold stripes on it. I've seen those nails where it's like a stripe across the top of like an, a different color. I wanna try and do that. So I should start with the red, cause that's lighter. I think I'm getting better at this. Easy. Oh, there's like fluff or something on there. This is so hard. And now, what was I doing with that one? Stripes. So I'm gonna get one of these out and I'm just gonna shove that into this gold. Mm. So I'm gonna shove this in here and then paint stripes onto this silver. Cute, look. Why do I have so many of these? Now, my next nail, I have some little hearts. Ugh. Ugh. I'm gonna do this one. Ugh. I think I'm gonna cover it in those little balls. That looks pretty cool. Okay, the stripes are finished. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of gold glitter on top. And I think the pink nail's done. So let's do a reveal of that. <gasps> oh, it tore off the nail polish. Okay, well, I mean, it's an artistic choice. I'm gonna put some gems on it, make it a disco ball. Okay, so now it's a disco ball nail. And this nail, I'm gonna put stickers on, I think. Okay, so now I'm gonna put the top coat on all of these. It's a matte top coat, so it is making a little effect. It is making a little effect. It's making a little effect. effect on the color, but we're just gonna have to go with it because that's what I have. Okay, top coat is on. So I'm just gonna put these away and then I'll show you the finished products. So these are the final nails. I'm just gonna go show the fam and get their opinion. What do you think of my nails? Yeah, there's something. And then this is my other hand. Oh, this one's cool. I like that one. She likes this one. What do you think of my nails? What do you think of my nails? <laughs> what do you think of my nails? What do you think of my nails? Do you like, oh.